Hi, it's Mike from healthnewswires.com. Obesity and diabetes. We know they're connected, but new research shows a more dangerous connection than we originally thought. Stay tuned. At the end of this report, I'm going to show you a product and a free uh, download that's going to provide information for you on ways to control your blood sugar, further reducing fat loss, and providing you with better health almost immediately. So new findings by a team of Harvard School of Public Health researchers demonstrates indisputable correlations between how people eat, their lifestyle choices, and even the medication that they use to treat diabetes. They're tying this to the extraordinary rise in obesity and diabetes rates in the United States over the last uh, 10 to 20 years. Going back to early civilization, uh, researchers have found that early humans were able to gain weight uh, quickly when large quantities of food were available. And I'm sure you can understand why. Um, If the food was there, they needed to eat it, they gained weight, and when the food wasn't there, they used that excess weight as energy to get them through the tough times. So that may have been a necessity for our ancient ancestors, Uh, However, the modern American diet is pretty rich in carbohydrates, um, genetically modified foods, processed foods, and large portions of red meat. All these are readily available on a daily basis. However, um, modern Americans continue to consume like there are times of plenty. Um, In other words, they're eating too much on a regular basis. This contributes to an environment that contributes to weight gain, insulin resistance, and diabetes, contributing to poor health. So the lifestyle choices that we make affect our weight, and our weight affects our health. So the Harvard researchers uh, provided compelling evidence demonstrating that lifestyle choices affect weight, and weight affects health, especially blood sugar levels and in developing diabetes. Specifically, being overweight increases the chance of developing diabetes five times. And severe obesity increases the risk of diabetes by 60 times. Further evidence tying overweight and diabetes together is provided by the fact that 30% of people overweight have diabetes, and an unbelievable 85% of diabetics are considered overweight. Uh, The number of people considered overweight or obese in America has increased from 13% to 34% in the last 40 years, and the number of people with diabetes has doubled during that same time period. Uh, It's important to know that not smoking eating properly, and keeping a healthy weight, uh, which means a body mass index of under 25, reduces the risk of diabetes by 90%. 90%. So I told you earlier there's a great supplement that will help you manage your blood sugar and your diabetes, uh, which will also contribute to fat burning and weight loss. It's called IC5. It's an advanced insulin support and carbohydrate management supplement from BioTrust, all natural. Uh, It's a great product. It's going to really assist you in managing blood sugar and burning fat. Also, there's a free download that you're going to want to take advantage of. You can click right on this report right now or at the end and take advantage of a free ebook. It's called Four Sneaky Tricks to Lower Your Blood Sugar. It provides a number of tips, including uh, the worst carbohydrates for blood sugar spikes, uh, alternatives to those. It also provides specific exercises proven to reduce blood sugar and insulin resistance. Um, The download includes ingredients that are easy to get at your grocery store that lower blood sugar and help regulate your blood sugar on a regular basis. And perhaps most importantly, uh, this download provides uh, tips that you can put into place immediately that have been proven to reduce or regulate blood sugar right away. So click on that, take advantage of uh, the free report, the free ebook, and I'm wishing you good health. 
This is Mike from Health News Wires.